Meghan Markle doesn't get on with Prince Harry's old friends, and experts say the feeling is mutual. Trending related articles Prince Harry's transition to life in the U.S., away from his pheasant shooting friends, is reportedly being embraced by his wife Meghan Markle, who allegedly doesn't get on with his former circle of friends, according to a royal expert. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex, who tied the knot in 2018, relocated to the U.S. in 2020 severing ties with their previous royal lifestyle and many of Harry's friends at the time. The couple are not believed to be troubled by the loss of these friendships, as a royal commentator suggests they are happy to forget their past life. Hugh Grosvenor, the seventh Duke of Westminster and a close friend of Harry, is set to wed in the coming days, but the Duke will not be present, reports the Mirror. Function load of script, let L equals document. Create element, script comma dot L dot set attribute. SRC, https comma slash slash live dot premies dot text slash live slash live view dot php dot s equals one one four nine four five player API it equals v one one four nine four five comma dot document dot get element by it of premies comma dot append child L flag tcf loaded dot equals equals undefined flag tcf loaded equals 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 dot zero load of script express app dot log load ovp flag tcf loaded new date else document dot add event listener tcf loaded equals greater than load of script express app dot log load ovp tcf loaded new date 1500 Royal expert and author Tom Quinn exclusively told The Mirror, Harry hates the idea of completely losing touch with his old Etonian and army friends and he was close to Hugh Grosvenor, but attending a wedding at which his brother will be an usher is just history repeating itself in the most painful way. Harry felt he should have been invited to be an usher, but once again his brother takes precedence. However, missing the wedding and gradually losing contact with his old friends isn't entirely negative for Harry. He is aware that Meghan detests many of his old woke hating, pheasant, shooting friends and those old friendships are still intertwined with the past that Harry is, in many ways, happy to leave behind. He elaborated, the truth is that many of Harry's old friends especially from the military and Eaton just don't get on with Meghan. Hugh Van Cutsum's decision to work with Jeremy Clarkson famous for his savage attacks on Meghan is seen by Harry as an unforgivable betrayal. The only thing that makes it bearable is that Harry knows Meghan dislikes Van Cutsum and his one claim to fame. His ability to shoot deer. He further commented, for Harry the end of his friendship with Van Cutsum is just cutting one of the last few ties with his old life. A life he never much enjoyed anyway. Harry's former friend Hugh Van Cutsum, who also happens to be a close friend of Prince William and has strong connections to King Charles through his father, has been in the spotlight recently. The banker and businessman has struck up a friendship with the candid TV personality Jeremy Clarkson even featuring on his program Clarkson's Farm. This move is viewed by Harry as a deep act of disloyalty following Clarkson's incendiary and contentious remarks in a column where he suggested Meghan should be publicly ridiculed. The falling out between Harry and Hugh seems to have been brewing over the past couple of years. Hugh's spouse Rosie Astor seemed to take a swipe at Harry and Meghan for their decision to step back from royal duties in 2020. At that time, Rosie posted on her social media, I am standing back as a senior member of my tax return because it'd rather drink coffee, see my friends, love my family and do yoga. Prince Harry disclosed in his 2023 autobiography Spare that there was friction between him and Hugh, detailing the backlash he faced following his bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey. In his tell, all book, Harry recounts, several close mates and beloved figures in my life, including one of Hugh and Emily's sons, Emily herself, and even Tiggy, Pettifer, his former nanny, had chastised me for Oprah. How could you reveal such things? about your family.